Hey, how's it going? I'm Tim Lezinski with Midwest Car Exchange out of Chicago. Um, we'd like to welcome all of our subscribers and followers worldwide. Today I'm bringing you a beautiful 1972 Ford Ranchero GT. Real GT, documented with a Marty Report. It's going to be essentially a good survivor car. Um, we're looking at 36,600 miles, um, believed to be original to the chassis. Um, we'll start with the interior. It looks like all original interior. Origi this is original seats, door panels, dashboard, um, all the gauge layout. Everything's crystal clear in beautiful condition. Um, looks showroom brand new. Everything is working. All the original glass is on it. Horns working. Radio. Lights, interior lights are all on. Um, but the interior itself, I would say, is um, damn near a 10. Headliner is in perfect condition. Um, not a bad aspect to the interior. Um, like I said, it's 36,000 original miles. The only thing that's really been done to the car um, as of recently was the engine bay was uh, repainted. They did a top end build on the engine so it could support the unleaded gas. You don't need any additive in it. Um, so it's a top end build on that 351 two barrel car, uh, a carb, and uh, it's a three speed automatic transmission. That's a factory one as well. Whole engine bay was freshened up to look uh, aesthetically brand new. The outside was repainted back to the factory original color because once again it was just an age factor on it. And um, but otherwise, all original metal interior, everything else has just been freshened up. So um, it's a good survivor. So let me um, take it around the block for you guys. We'll uh, we'll chat a little bit more about it. it could be power steering, power disc brake in the front, air conditioning car. Air conditioning was actually just redone. We did it ourselves and uh, we converted it over to the 134. So that is um, that has been updated. Initially, right away, got a great tone. Sounds great. The exhaust wise. Um, steering is solid, very, very tight on the car. It's not floating at all. Tracks down the road perfectly straight. I'll get on the brakes a little bit here for you. It doesn't even want to fall side to side at all, so that's phenomenal. Um, we put a brand new set of radial um, BFG T8 tires on it. So those are brand spanking new, maybe 20 miles on them. We're gonna do a quick lap right here. Got original manual set for it. I want you guys to get over to my website too when I'm done with this video to check out all the additional photos I do have in the car. I've got a good 80 to 100 photos on the car, inside and out, undercarriage. So you'll get a really good feel for the car. Um, I know a lot of the websites that I advertise on don't offer every photo, my website does. My website is mce cars.com you'll see it at the end of this video as well plenty of power there like i said brakes work great just locked them up a little bit right there so i've got nothing but great things to say about this car uh anyone's gonna be very very happy for just over twenty thousand dollars you, re you really can't beat this car um there's not really a single bad aspect to it i'm, I'm really trying to find one bad aspect to it even all the chrome on the dash here looks great. The body is nice and straight. Paint stunning on it. Chrome, stainless. Um, you're going to get a great car all the way around. Let me do a quick walk around video for you guys. Once I wrap up that walk around, um, like I said, visit the website mcecars.com. It's really e easy to navigate around there. I've got full HD images. You can blow up to the full size of your screen and get a good feel for it. But um, yeah, I got nothing bad to say. Everything works even down to the annoying buzzer. So let's do our quick walk around. Thanks. Mm -hmm. 